not my best angle. It is cold, cold. It feels like East Coast cold. It's really cold. It's like 20 degrees. And I'm actually on my way to get a haircut. And I could not be bothered to put on real clothes. So I have on sweatpants. I have on. Let's see if we can do. Oh, TD! From the driver's seat. You see me. So that's what's going on. Me and Jaden, we are going to Vegas for Jaden's homegirl, my new homegirl's birthday. There's gonna be top golf. There's gonna be drinks. There's gonna be brunches. There's gonna be sun. There's gonna be tans. There's going to be blacks. There's gonna be laughter, joy, hips. So just, you know, stay tuned for that. But what was I gonna say? What was I gonna say? Ooh. I don't remember. We're flying out to Vegas today. I got my hair did. The camera cut off on me earlier. I don't even remember what I was about to say, but I think that that was the, the universe. Every time I film, you're doing something, making it look like I don't ever help you do anything. I was doing things. That's the point. <laughs> Before you started filming, I was already God. Up. You would know what I'm talking about. This is wild that I'm getting yelled at. Whoa. For doing things, okay? It's not for doing <laughs> things. It's just, you, I feel like you time it. You just time it. I was, way. What, I, what I was saying was, I started doing things before you filmed. I was literally off doing and on. Dishes. You I was were doing off. Dishes. Man, whatever. See? You I'm know what I'm doing talking doing about if I you. I did nothing wrong. Why do you why do you sound or look so angry at me all of a sudden? We were just fucking around. I was going, yeah. <laughs> Embarrassing the fuck out of me. <laughs> Good thing I did not make it work because uh... I would have refused. <clears throat> but yeah, our flight to Vegas is late, or our flight flight to LA is in like three hours. I gotta say, early evening flights is the way to go. I am not stressed yeah. at all. And I got to get a haircut this morning. Yeah, we did a lot already to prepare and we didn't have to clean as much, but still. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we are all packed up. I just, well, we both just need to pretty much change but our toiletries, everything, clothes, outfits. Let me show y'all Jaden's board. So Jaden made this board of outfits, what we're doing, when, and a master list of everything that needs to be packed. Um, I guess that's it. I guess we'll, ah! There's an ant on my shoulder! <laughs> uh! So what's happening? Turn her off. Uh! Babe, stop stretching out your sweater. It's getting me. And I'm trying on pieces from uh, an order that I made, Jeriff Avenue. Jaden showed me, and in a matter of minutes, I had made a purchase. This jacket being one of those purchases. Um, I don't have my tripod or anything, so. Light is not great, but if I end up wearing it, then you'll see it. We just got in like, what, an hour-ish ago. I don't miss LAX, because LAX is a lot. Because you gotta like, get off the plane, you gotta walk to baggage claim, and hope that you get your baggage within, within a few minutes, and you gotta take a bus to the place where you can get a car, then you gotta book the car, then the car gotta get out to the place, then the car gotta actually find the place, because the place is not the same thing as the airport, because it has its own designated thing. It's a whole thing. We're great. Um, one of those packages that I ordered for the trip, it was a little cute ear cuff. So cute, it was gonna go like right here, um, they sent it back because I don't live here <laughs> and my name was on the package. So I'm gonna try and call and hope that I can at least, you know, get them to hold it so I can just go pick it up or something, whatever. <sighs> but anyway, I'm gonna check in with y'all later. We just gonna eat and chill and rest um, and prepare for tomorrow. So I will check in with y'all. This is Jaden's Oud. Uh, I don't know what kind of Air Forces these are, but those with the pink sock to match. Ooh. Got the karate pants. Ooh. Got the bandana bag. Yeah. 
got the the oversized Zara shirt and then the green this Kelly green what tank top crop crop tank yeah. top oh and then <laughs> we got the black owned brand shady side up glasses and yeah hair clip, hair clip. Oh, wait provided by the best and and this oh yeah Tracy this is Tracy Ellis Russ hair clip it is pattern yeah cool and in my rings rings this is Vitaly by the way this is my favorite this is my mom's high school ring it's so pretty it has her name on the inside can you see it I have no idea Anna I don't Anna. know dog Anna give me matching necklace oh yeah <laughs> oh yeah both of them on yeah two J's because I'm a fire sign she narcissistic period my turn tell him, tell him baby Got okay, your, your blue burks. Wait, step in the sun so you can see them. Hey, wait, that I'm way. I see this way. No, put your feet this way. Yeah, there you go. Look how bright those babies are. We're dressing strictly for comfort today and vibes. Yes. That's it. So, you got your baggy jeans. Got the light blue or the electric blue burks on for a little pop of something. Um, and then I got these oversized jeans from Zara in that vlog that you should have watched. I'll mm. link it in the description this inside out t-shirt and the brand is called I think this is Ray R-A-E-Y I think oh the pants the same as those pants yes oh cool I could be lying about that one. Um, and then to keep the kind of unfinished raw denim vibe that we're going uh, I have this boyfriend trucker I think that's what it's called it's a trucker jacket it's Levi's no Levi's I cut off the um what do you, what do you, the what would you call the thing that's attached here? Oh my god, the wrist. The wrist. The, what is uh, the cuff? Cuff. Yeah, yeah, I cut off the cuffs, and so it's got like it kind of gives me a Margella vibes. And the and then I also cut off the collar too, just to give it an effect. Because I never wore that jacket, and I didn't want to like throw it away or anything or donate it because I liked it, but I had to make myself like it more. Oh, and my new case to five case. Ooh, you got rings on today. I don't know rings. Oh, you got bracelets. I got bracelets. Um, Hella bracelets. Same bracelets as always. Vitaly. Vitaly. I got this in LA at a flea market from this very generous white woman. So. <laughs> oh, and then my Oh, one. yeah. Which is where we got our necklaces too, right? Mm hmm I don't have my J on today. I just have my Louis, the Vivian Westwood, and then I have my go-to every day. I call this my little, um, my little fuckboy chain. <laughs> Because I have this on every day. And that's it. And we're about to go get some lunch. And shopping. Shop. Meet up with some people. That's why we just for comfort, folks. Yeah. Comfort, but yeah. With effort. And we out. Call me Tuesday. Tuesday. I got food up in the fridge. Y'all keep looking for that new way. I think I like it how it is. Y'all, how do I put the beret on? Do you let some of your hair poke out the top or do you just put it all in? Whatever you want. I think I like it with the hair. How you had it when you first put it. Oh, look at your, I don't look know your little right. hairs. <laughs> so we'll get them. I think I like it how it is. All right, y'all, so. This is a pair of the 96 jeans. This is how they're fitting me. And they fit me like a glove. I feel like it's really, really flattering. Even if I like untuck this, casual, cool. I would probably also wear <laughs> these with that. I might wear these pants to Top Golf if I buy them. Get it, Jaden. Get it, Jaden. We're packing up my best friend's car, and it's this little baby Mini Cooper. And there's four of us, and we're all women. And we're driving to Vegas. Y'all, tell me why we are going to attempt to drive four hours in. this little car um,
What you got on? What you got on? Okay, so I got on my baby sweater. Baby sweater. Uh, we're gay. Shout out to the designer over there. Uh, you don't gotta be too close. I was getting a close up of the sweater. Okay. And I got these giant pants that Jaden thrifted. Aren't they so cute? They're like a grayish, greenish. Yeah, they're like giant cargo pants. Five. And I don't understand the construction of these pants. Like, like I feel like they are like there's extra room in the knee. So, which makes me think that they're like workwear pants, but they're thin. Mm. Anyway, so I got those on mm. Air Jordan ones because they're just a comfortable <laughs> shoe, and we love ankle support. <laughs> hey. I don't have any of my jewelry on because we're just driving. So. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Bree. Did you find your phone? I did. No, she I did. did. Or boob tape. Oh, boob tape. Oh, smart. Fantastic. Smart. Do you want to do yours? Yeah. Jaden wants to do her outfit too. <laughs> Honestly, this is all Jaden shit. So. Um, I did a cute bun on her yesterday. Oh, you did. I had the same glasses. Yesterday, same shirt. This shirt, another crop tank though. Yes, <laughs> from Ari. Yeah. Ribbed. It's cute, or whatever. And then Jade's Rick shorts. Mm -hmm. Cute. And my sweet coat sandals. Also, Jade's. She gave them to me though. We don't look like we're dressed for the same place. No. Well, you look like you're cold. I'm always cold. And I'm always cold, baby. Oh, same necklace too. Ice cold. Noon. <laughs> Bree, you want to show them your fit? Here. <laughs> this is a Dolls Kill Exclusive. Pants jogger set. Nice. You have the black detail. Okay. You have wow. the TJ Maxx off brand MIA Yeezy slides. Off black? Off brand. black. Off brand. And then you have classic white tee. Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. From Fashion district. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> Mac, you wanna show people your fit? No. Okay. <laughs> Alright y'all, we were at the first rest stop and it is cold. It's like I don't know, but it is breezy. I'm looking at the mountains back there. I'm gonna show you. And there's ice on them. It's snow on the mountain. And look at what my girlfriend's wearing. What? You cold? Y'all, we made it to the room. We made it to the Vegas. To the Vey. That's the front door giving you, you know, red light district. It's giving you silhouette challenge. Then we got two beds. It's just a basic room. It's just the two beds. And then velvet red couch. Over here. That's pretty much it. You what have happened? Cord? No. Yeah, you did. You only took it from behind the couch. I put it in the back. Okay. I don't know. So what do you mean? It's pro it's either in this one know, like the plan or the um band the tote. Yeah, we gotta get our energy up, we gotta change. Are we about to like instantly change and go get food? No, because we don't have we don't know where we're going. We don't got a plan yet. Hey. Hey. Where are we going? What are we doing? What's going on? Uh shit. Um we gonna link with the friends in a minute. Finishing up, but we doing OOTDs. And this is for Top Golf, okay? And it's cold in Vegas. So this is mainly another fit where I'm dressing for comfort first. Um, so I decided to keep it simple. Calvin Klein, Heron Preston, 
trucker jacket. I have the same hair, Calvin Klein hair and present t-shirt underneath. I decided to just bundle up. <laughs> um, and then I got these new Acme Studios 1996. Oh, so cute. They're jeans. brown, if anyone's wondering. Yeah, they look brown. And then I got on the Dark Shadow, we're going remotes. And then on the hands, Vitaly, as always, sponsoring my hands. Uh, Vitaly, 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 Vitaly. This is from Jaden's mom that I stole. <laughs> Thrifted vintage Jaden's mom. And then the same old, y'all know, y'all know. We do the Louis Shane necklace. and the Viv. The same thing. But Jaden looks real cute, so I'm gonna show y'all. Fix my bra. Hey. Hey. What you wearing? I'm wearing a thrifted shirt. <laughs> nice. It's tucked into my pants, so it looks like one of those butterfly tops. Mm -hmm. um, these new jeans that I got from Zara. They're huge, and I really like them. And then Jade's Nikes. <laughs> with a light blue sock. With the baby blue sock. <laughs> Don't you were supposed to see that. Yes. She did something different with her makeup today. <gasps> Ooh, pretty. Same rings as yesterday? Yeah, probably. probably. Same rings as yesterday. And then I have a blazer that I'm wearing. You want to put the blazer on and show the people the full? Yeah, it's not here. Y'all, it's like proper cold. Proper cold. It's like, what, low low 50s, Yeah. high what do you need Jade and I both got it in different sizes. Mm -hmm. That's the look. I'm gonna back up because I feel like I need to get a little. Oh, and bandana bag, too. Y'all, I am not good at golf. Um, turns out I'm trash. At golf, um, um, I'm I'm like a baby beast with a little club joint. But other, why am I talking to my phone? I gotta go. She looks like Nicole Scherzinger and uh, Selma Hayek mixed together. We are live. Why would you tell them that? Why would you say that? I don't know. She's. Have you seen from dusk till dawn? Babe? From dusk till dawn. Oh, wait, she's like a vampire. You look just like her though. That's what she fucking likes. Like just because my boobs look like hers. <laughs> yeah. That's the same face. Yeah, that's the same face and boobs. <laughs> it's our first like official full day. They're talking about my Selma Hayek crush night number one. Today <laughs> is the first official full day. Technically the second day though that we're here. How did everyone enjoy themselves? I think yesterday was like a nice. Yeah. Yeah, it was, was an like, icebreaker day. I was insecure about my boobs being out because they kept pulling on my bra. Yeah, Jane had her boobs out last night. Because they kept pulling on my bra. <laughs> I didn't see that. Because they kept pulling on my Thank you. I was just so high. You were just way too high. Baby. I told Mackenzie that was going to happen though. She was like, you'll be fine. He, and you were fine. And guess what? You wanted more. You did. You did want more. I did not want more. Yeah, you did. You want more. Yeah, that was after Meg lost it. Well, give me more. Oh, you don't want to yeah. Okay, yeah, we got to go and get dressed. Jaden's trying on shoes, and I don't know why this man needs to. Come on. Yeah, I can. I can. I can try one. No, I think. Yeah, I think this is good. Can I try both? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Surprisingly not. It's surprisingly not uncomfortable. Yeah. Like it, like holds your foot. Yeah. Ooh, they're tall enough for these pants. So, <laughs> there's this bag. It's an MCM bag. I thought it was a toiletry bag, but it's like a bag bag. 
that's cute. It is. This is also cute. And I was just telling Jaden, I was like, in 2022, am I going to pay $8.50 for an MCM bag? Maybe. Wait and see. Well, we have to come back through here when we leave. Right? So that'll give me the time to think. Sure. Okay, there we go. This is kind of tight. I'm not mad. Even like... The blue one? surprised that I've been able to keep up with this vlog as much as I have. We're about to um, go oops, go to Erin's room because she's staying in the suite contemplating if I want to do blush. I don't know. I, that's too much. You see it's too much. It's too much. I don't know what I'm going to talk about or what I wanted to talk about but I'm going to show you all the final fit and I think this might be the final fit of the whole weekend. I might do one more. I don't really know. Y'all gonna see it if you see it, but um, I don't know how much I filmed, but I did pop in a diesel. So many good things. I low-key wanna go back tomorrow because I was on a time crunch while I was there. And so I didn't get the chance to like fully, you know, try things on, fully go through, be thorough. I didn't get a chance to do that. So I might try and do that back in LA because I do have a section or I, they do have a location there. Either way, I'm gonna let y'all know. And either way, I'm about to take some shots. So I'm gonna catch up with y'all later. Get ready for flashing lights, lights, lights. Nah, but for real, if you be having like seizures and stuff, just like look away because this is flashes. <laughs> full OOTD of the night out that you just saw where I was dancing my little ass off. And so I'm gonna just include this little photo, okay? We're gonna give you a nice blazer. Okay, that's that crop blazer from H&M, that good $40 crop blazer from H&M. And underneath that, I have my Craig Green t-shirt. And as you know, that t-shirt, which I have right here, this t-shirt has this string on it. And I got a lot of compliments. I think people thought it was custom. It definitely was not custom, but it's just this t-shirt, it has a string on it. And instead of wearing it like this and throwing the blazer on on top, I took the string and I had it go over the blazer just to make it feel a little bit more like something. Because otherwise I'm just wearing a t-shirt, a black blazer and black pants. Uh, and those black pants are these pants that are from the brand Sport Max. And I absolutely thought these were golf pants when they came in the mail, but they're more of just like a casual black pant and they have that nice split hem at the bottom. Um, I got these on sale at 
from HBX, either HBX or N.com. Everything is going to be linked down in the description if it is still available. Welcome to the end of the vlog, the beginning of the haul. I'm about to show you everything that I purchased while I was in Vegas and also a couple things that I purchased in LA. Uh, there's a little portion of this vlog that I didn't include just because it was so short and there was barely any footage of it anyway, but we did pop over to Beverly Center mall and i think we went into like nordstrom and uh i went into cost cost had these pants they were so nice i don't think they were worth a hundred dollars a hundred of the dollars that they said i needed to spend in order to acquire them i didn't think it was worth all of that which is why i did not pick them up but cost had a lot of really nice pieces um if you're into like or if you're looking for vacation wear like menswear vacation wear that's you know your nice linens your nice lyocell blend shirts and what have you cost got that stuff for you i'm actually going to start off with the very first if i get blown out during this process i am so sorry the sun Y'all, the sun is coming out in Portland again, and so y'all already know. I'm gonna have to keep telling y'all every single one of these videos now, if there's some issues with the lighting, it's just gonna have to come and go, okay? And don't say Nathan, cause I can't control it. But um, I actually wanted to show you the very first package, uh, the very first thing that I got, which was a package that I ordered from Jerf Avenue. I talked about this in another video recently. I had it delivered to, um, Mackenzie, our friend Mackenzie's apartment because that's where we were staying before we drove out to Vegas. A little disappointed, but let me show y'all. So I got three things total, but technically like two pieces. So this is a set. It is a chocolate brown set. It's very straight cut, you know, size medium. It's a, it's a brown set. There's not much to it. And I didn't think there would be much to it, but the fit is weird. It's not giving, I don't quite know what it is giving, but I don't want it. It's kind of, I remember, I mean, I have not worn this since I originally uh, tried it on in LA, but I have a feeling in the bureau, it's still not gonna be giving. There's just something about the fit of it, something about how loose it is just doesn't quite, uh, there's something about it I don't love. However, I do think that the quality is great. I like the vent in the back of the shirt. I think that it gives it, you know, kind of a nice little feature, makes it feel a little less uh, plain. Um, I really like how the light hits this because sometimes it gives you kind of like that ashy kind of suede kind of look. It's also very soft. It's perfect for vacation. It's perfect for, you know, um, your, your easy, like your airport fits, your easy like run around kind of fit where you don't have to put too much effort into it yet you look good and you're really comfortable because it's basically an elevated pajama set. I just don't love it on me. So no shade to Jerf, much, much, uh, much appreciation to Jerf, but it was a no for me. So something that's been consistent with the, both of the things, of both of the pieces that I got from Jerf Avenue is the fit is a little awkward because it feels like it's meant to be a men's piece, yet the fit isn't, it feels like they took some features of menswear and then some features of women's wear and then put them into one. And ideally I think that would work, but for me, it just kind of looked a little awkward. However, I do really like this jacket. It is a essentially kind of like a coach jacket, but the collar is up and it, it features this kind of like double headed zipper where you can zip it up or down from the top or the bottom, which gives it a nice kind of like styling feature because you can have it zipped all the way to the top and have a little bit of the bottom out and say you don't have a shirt on underneath, you show your little belly button or something. If that's something that you wanna do, you could wear it all the way open. Um, you can have it kind of like an X kind of feature in the front where you have the zips kind of meeting in the middle. So I do like that little added detail to this. I think that it makes it really great for styling. However, for the purposes of the trip, I didn't really find a use for it. And to be honest, I put in the order and I got it shipped there in hopes that it would work with something that I got. But for real, for real, I just could not get my fits together. I could not get anything together for this trip that I really, really liked. So I made stuff work. We went shopping, y'all saw the vlog. Um, we went shopping again in Vegas, y'all saw this vlog. And so I just, I don't know, it's just been a swing and a miss lately. That said, I'm going to keep this jacket, not so sure about the set just yet, um, cause I think that I can make this work for sure and I'd rather have it than not have it. So as you saw, um, earlier in the vlog, me and Jaden went over to Acme Studios and I didn't even know 
that they had an LA location. I mean, I don't even know if I was even really into Acme Studios that much before I moved to a, moved out of LA. I feel like I was though, which is why I'm surprised I didn't know that they had a location there. I think she said they had two. Uh, shout outs to um, the sales associate over there, Vera. Thank you for all your help. Um, I went ahead and made my first my first in-store Acme Studios purchase. I'm actually wearing my Acme Studios knot ring right now. But going went ahead and made my first purchase and it is the 1996 uh, jeans. That's like the name of the model. And you know what guys, similarly to ranch dressing, I too at times can be too thick. And so I was surprised that one, these jeans fit me the way that they do. And two, that I enjoy the way that they fit me because y'all know I'm a loosey goosey girl. I don't really like slim fit like that. That's not really my jam. And I would say these are definitely on the slimmer side. I don't know the way that, they are, that these are described, but I wanna say that they are meant to be more of a straight leg, and they are, they definitely are, but they are more fitted. And I don't know if they're fitted because I got a little, just a little jacket and jacket. I don't know if it's because of that or if it's because that's just the way that they fit. But I do really love the wash of these. It's this really beautiful, like brown aged kind of vibe. And it's also got these little pink, got these little pink details near the rivets. Also on the inside of the jeans as well. They do stretch, not a lot, but they do stretch. Like when I wore these to Top Golf because I ended up not having anything else, so I ended up wearing these to Top Golf. Um, I was afraid that you know the activity of Top Golf would be a bit much, but it wasn't. Definitely need to wear these with a belt though because I was my crack. Oh, my butt, my crack, my back, my neck, and my back was about to be on show, okay? Because of the way every, every time I had to bend down. But luckily, we did not show anybody things. We did not show places where the sun don't shine. I don't know, if y'all are interested in pricing, I believe these came out to be around like 350 or so, um, which is steep for a pair of denim, but I'm gonna keep these forever. I have, no long history with Acme Studios as far as like my knowledge. Um, I do know that they started off as like a design firm and then from there they kind of broke off into, you know, the fashion world. But I don't have, I don't know what the credits are giving when it comes to their history with making denim, but I really like them. So regardless of what it is, I know that it's a quality product. I know that I feel good in them and that they fit well. And I will most likely keep these for years to come. Another piece that I picked up from the Beverly Center, uh, specifically from the store Oak and Fort. I didn't even end up wearing this, the tag is still on it. Uh, Oak and Fort is a store that I've heard of before. It's a store I think I almost worked with once before, but um, I went in there because I had broke off from the pack, I broke off from the group and I had done my own thing. You know how you just, it's just easier to shop when you buy yourself, you know what I mean? No shade, because that was really fun when we went shopping and all that. But, um, I picked up the sweater vest, thinking I was gonna give you a cute, like Jaden Smith, I was gonna give you a cute, like Tyler the Creator kind of vibe with this, specifically because it was so small, this was the last one, and I knew I probably wouldn't get away with like a oversized t-shirt underneath. So I was like, okay, well maybe we just have no shirt underneath and we just have like the guns out, you know what I mean? And we just like rock it that way. But Vegas ended up being burr, burr as fuck. So that's why I never actually wore this because uh, it was too cold to have my arms out. But originally I think I was gonna like, I don't even know where I was supposed to be wearing this or what I even had in mind. This was low key, high key and impulse buy because I was on a time crunch. I felt like I didn't pack at adequately enough. Uh, I just didn't really feel like I had like any good fits. The only really good fit I feel like I had was my club fit to be honest. Everything else was just thrown together. I even repeated an outfit because your girl was just not prepared. So I bought this thinking that I would be able to make it work with something and pull something off. I never even ended up wearing it, but I'm still gonna keep it. I still think that it's really nice. It's got this nice kind of like picnic looking diamond uh, pattern all over it. It kind of gives me houndstooth, but not. 
Um, I also really like this colorway of the red and the, cr and the cream. It's very much springtime to me. And surprisingly, I have a lot of shoes that could go with this. And I think that this with like some oversized denim um, will be a cute look for springtime. This is the last item that I'm going to be showing you all. I went to Diesel, as you saw in the vlog in Vegas, and they had so much cool stuff. If you didn't tune into Diesel's uh, Fashion Week show, uh, their spring summer, I don't know if it was their spring summer or if it was fall winter or not. I don't remember which one it was. I think it was spring summer though. Please watch that show. Such good looks, such great like inspo content coming out of that little 16 minute video. So I'm gonna link it down in the description if you have not watched it. But I went into Diesel because when I saw it, I was like, well, I have to go because any, every Diesel piece that I've had, I've had to buy online because there isn't one here in Portland. And so when I saw that they had a store, I absolutely had to pop in. And I picked up this t-shirt. I have no idea if it's from men's or the women's section, but it's almost this, it kind of gives me like Fast and Furious vibes. Y'all ever seen that movie? It's like a, it's like a, uh, <laughs> it's like an off-brand version of Fast and Furious and it's called Torque. And it's the same thing as Fast and Furious, but black. I feel like my character in Torque would wear this shirt because it kind of gives me motocross, it kind of gives me moto vibes with, you know, the ribbing around and the contrast stitch stitching around the shoulders because it kind of gives you the effect of it being a pad, like a, like a padded jacket or like a padded garment that you would wear for protection. Like it kind of gives that, but it's not. It's just a nice little like ribbed fabric here. It's also ribbed here in the back as well. And I think that this attention around the shoulders just makes your shoulders look really good. Um, I don't have very broad or distinct shoulders. My shoulders are giving very much average. You know what I mean? Nothing to talk about, nothing to write home about shoulders. But these give me like, oh, she has Michelle Obama shoulders. She's known for her shoulders if you didn't know that. So that's how I feel when I wear this and I was really pleased. I was really happy with the fit of it. This is definitely a slimmer fit than what I'm used to wearing. And I feel like I'm kind of getting into slim fits now. So who knows? Maybe this is my like vibe going into spring, summer. Y'all let me know what y'all are wearing and let me know if you enjoyed this vlog. I had a really good time editing this vlog. Sometimes worrying about the performance of things just really ruins stuff because I forgot how much I really enjoyed making vlogs because I they normally didn't perform that well on my other channel. But anyways, I hope that you would like this video. I really enjoyed putting it together. Um, shout outs to Aaron, Corey, Mac, Bree, Lex, B, everybody in Vegas uh, who made it what it was. Happy birthday, Aaron. And I hope y'all like this video and I'll see y'all very soon in another one. And do not forget, wear what you want, wear what you like, wear it out.